Hello there. So today um, we are looking at uh, the Thought Book, non-fiction, um, by Jay Mullings. And he is known um, uh, in other formats, if you know what I mean. So he also writes The Written Mirror. He's a screenwriter, a very successful screenwriter. So this is a bit of a change um, for him. And I have to say, I wasn't quite sure what to expect. Um, I, I read a lot of self-helpy books and having worked all those years in mental health, uh, recovery. I've, I kind of feel I've read quite a few. Um, this uh, this is slightly different. It's um, his thoughts, if you know what I mean, things that he has found um, powerful for him, and he's just shared them. So the entire book is just these sort of statements um, that he's found powerful and and helpful. Um, and the, the idea is not that you agree with them all or like them all even, but that they challenge you in some way or they make you, you know, you might find one that does really uh, speak to you in some way. And, you know, you might pop that on a note or on your um, screen of your computer or on your fridge or something. Um, and it's really just meant to be a kind of thought provoking book, I suppose. What's interesting about it, or slightly different, is that there are blank spaces where you can, you know, if there's a if there's a quote you use often or one you find really inspiring, you can pop that in there. So you can kind of write within the book yourself. Um, so it's rather lovely. I mean, what's not to like? It's um, There are a couple in there that really I, I enjoyed, things I hadn't come across before. And as I say, I've, I've you know, I've heard most of the well-known quotes because, and I've used a lot of them. Um, but uh, there were a couple I found that I did really enjoy, and I and I think, oh, I might, you know, I might make myself a little. Um, I can't re even remember how to do it. You can make your screensaver on your computer be typing. I have to see if I can remember how. Um, and I, I think it's it's it was great for that. A couple of them didn't do much for me, um, but that's also quite nice. And a couple of them made me think of other people. So there's a few emails I might shoot off to people saying, oh, you know, I read this line and it just felt it felt like where you are at and you might find it helpful. So it was rather lovely. It was um, quite inspiring, quite challenging. Some of them, um, you know, I didn't agree with or um, and, and that's quite good, actually, I think, because that makes you it's nice sometimes to know what we don't like is just as valuable sometimes as what we do. So all in all, um, quite thought provoking and definitely worth a look um, and definitely worth, I would suggest, um, if you do like how Jay thinks and how he operates, which, you know, none of us are for everyone, um, then I would suggest following him on other social media because I, you know, I found him quite an interesting uh, character. Um, and that's always good, isn't it, to to bolster our numbers of people in our lives that um, that challenge us and help us. So um, the thought book by Jane Mullings, give it a go.